the Tracy Johnson Show. I'm Joe Wamba, joined now with Tracy Johnson, head coach of the women's ice hockey team. And coach, you know, step one of goals and expectations of the season, making it into the CHC playoff and then winning the first game uh, against Johnson and Wales 2-1. to one. How do you guys feel about that game, first of all? Well, we were prepared all week about um, – putting the puck in the net and uh, you know we knew we were facing the goaltender of the year in our conference and um, that it was likely going to be uh, a close game like it was and luckily we we did find a way to do that and um, punched our ticket to the final four but goaltender of the year on the ice and player of the year on the ice so there's definitely some fireworks there and you know they didn't disappoint at all they did not uh, you know it was a good game all around I think we are ready to get prepared going into this final weekend and it, it's weird that's going to be our last week of practice but uh you know we're doing what we can to, to keep the energy high and uh just get ready for for a fun weekend and it definitely is uh looking up to be a fun weekend you guys are going to play endicott on saturday at 12 30 a team that you guys have played pretty tight all season what are your you know what are the things you're focusing on heading into this game i think Again, bringing some energy and uh, just being ready to go and focus on what we need to do to play our game. This is a you know a rematch of the championship game last year, and so we know that they're going to come out with a chip on their shoulder and looking for a little bit of revenge. So you know we have to be ready to give them a full sixty minutes of our game, and uh, you know hoping that it's another good, exciting weekend. Well, you guys got an opportunity to get revenge your, yourselves too for how you, uh, the games went earlier in the season. Or is that any part of your mindset, you know, how those games went to get you prepared for these games? Absolutely. We definitely have to keep that in mind and, and know that, you know, they beat us twice in our house. So uh, I think that's a, an excellent point where we have to remember, you know, that feeling and and be ready to go. And, um, you know, that was back in November and we're a different team and they're a different team. So uh, excited to see what both teams put on the ice on Saturday. And just to keep reiterating the fact, Chelsea Blackburn play of the year. We've talked about her all the time, but Monica Posick and Natalie Rosendahl, also second team uh, all-conference. Just having those three on the ice uh, on line matchups, what does that do in, teams of, in terms of morale for the team? I think it's important to have, you know, just great leadership from our entire junior class as a mm -hmm. whole. Um, you know, it, it's a great um, recognition for the three of them, absolutely. But, um, you know, can't understate what the rest of our team has done to help put them in those positions as well. So, uh, you know, hockey is one of the quintessential team sports. And, um, you know, we we have certain players that obviously get the attention, but mm -hmm. you, you also need the players that don't necessarily show up in the awards or on the score sheet to to be ready to go you know you, you win games with with those players and so we're we're excited to get you know just prepared for a full team effort this weekend that's a that's a very good point to make you know those players do get the recognition but if they don't get the puck on their stick it's not going in right. you know and they're one of the best finishers and assisters on the ice and but the rest of the team is doing that for you as well absolutely and you know, we take a lot of pride in trying to play discipline D zone and D zone is something that doesn't necessarily show up on, on the stat sheet as mm -hmm. much, you know, obviously it, with goals against, you can kind of track it that way. But, um, you know, a lot of things that, that, uh, it, it takes a lot to win and mm -hmm. it's not always just the point production. You, you need that as well. But, um, again, just really need a full team effort for a full 60 minutes and 65 if need, if need be, or even longer than that. Yeah. So, you know, it's playoffs. So there's no, you know, you play overtime until it's over, you know, um, and it's, it's, it's an exciting, exciting time for hockey. Yeah. There's something to remember from last year's championship game. Those overtimes. I think there were, there were overtime games in almost all of those final three. Mm -hmm. So hopefully we can avoid that get it done in 60 this, this that's year what around. i'm hoping to yeah. yeah well coach we wish you the best of luck in there and maybe we're playing on sunday bringing home the cup again yeah hope so thank you good luck coach she's tracy johnson i'm joe wamba this has been the tracy johnson show